What's going on guys? Today we're going to be looking at the brand new Steve Largent. But before we hop into it, if you are new here, hit the subscribe button. We are less than 100 subscribers away from 2,000. So hit the subscribe button, turn notifications. We post daily Madden content. And most likely while you are watching this, I am live on Twitch. So go ahead and hit the link in the description and come check out the stream. And we do have a giveaway going on right now for two $25 gift cards uh, for any console. So anyone can win, anyone can join. It's completely free. You can literally win free money. So there's no reason why you shouldn't be entered already. And how you enter is you have to be subscribed to the channel. You got to follow me on Twitch, follow me on Twitter, and then DM me screenshots on Twitter of you doing those things and you are entered in. And I'm picking the winners for that giveaway on Monday in my next Reddit video. So be on the lookout for that. And uh, yeah, without further ado, let's hop into it. All right, so here is Gold 99, Steve Largent. Uh, this card is a limited time card, so most likely if you are going to get this card or want to or want to just try him out, you're going to have to use a power pass on him. If you do use the power pass on him, this, you, you can probably power this card up for around like 100k. And you, and you get a receiver with 97 speed, 91 jumping, 99 catching, 99 catching traffic, 98 spec catch, 98 short route running, 99 medium with 99 deep. This card could be a demi, I'm not going to lie. This card could be a demi. He could really be a demi. Bro, he's fast, great route running. With, with a 99 deep route running, he's going to feel way faster. Uh, he, like, w w Yeah, like, dude, this card looks so, so good. We're going to compare him to uh, Tory Holt. I'll hide the face cam for you guys. Looking at this right now, I'm taking Steve Largent again. Steve Largent looks way better. Not way better, but he, he is better. Yes, Tory Holt is faster, but Steve Largent has the better catch in traffic, the better spec catch, the better catching, the better route running as well. Dude, this Steve Largent card looks really, really good. Compared to DeAndre Hopkins, I don't know if there's even a point comparing these two cards because Steve Largent does everything that DeAndre Hopkins can do, but better. He really can, and he is faster. Damn, this I can't wait to use this card. So looking at Steve Largent's abilities, we got max security 100, which he starts the game with activated. High success rate on all possession catches. So most likely, if I throw this guy the ball and possession catch, he's probably going to come down with it. Um, this guy, because of his ability and because of the route running and the speed and the release, he's one of the best receivers between the numbers for medium and short route runnings. Like, dude, this guy's going to be an absolute beast like for short routes. And we got grab on go on him, cross specialist, post flag elite, and route technician. Um, here are the abilities that he can get. So he can get route apprentice, uh, playmaker. But you should always run routes apprentice on a receiver if you don't have a quarterback with high route master. But for this gameplay, I will be using Tua, so he has high route master, so I don't need to run route apprentice. But if you don't have high route master, definitely run route apprentice. He also gets QB playmaker, so if you like running playmakers, you can put this on him. And I like putting route technician because on all routes, he does get boosted route running. And as far as the elite and specialist abilities, it all comes down to preference. Whatever plays, whatever routes you like running in this game, I would put that on this guy so he gets boosted catching and route running on those as well. So uh, yeah, that, those are his abilities. And for Team Chemistry, Seattle Seahawks, they have the best receiving court in Madden right now. It's not even a question. Jerry Rice, Devin Hester, Joe Dravicious, uh, Tyler Lockett. <laughs> Dude, their receivers are just crazy. And uh, yeah, so we got Sprinter 30-30 and we got Go Deep 35 out of 30 for that plus two deep route running and plus two spec catch. And for front arts, like I said earlier, he is a limited time. So he only gets this front art. And a couple NFL 100 front arts as well. And his power up front art. So yeah, without further ado, let's hop into the gameplay. I'm looking forward to using this card. Let's see how he plays. All right, here we go. There's Steve Largent, Walter Payton, Jadavian Clowney. And he's got Steve Young, Byron Jones, and Night Train Lane. Looks like he's running a 49ers theme team. And we are starting on offense. Oh no, this guy's rocking the black 49ers jerseys. If you ever face a guy wearing the black 49ers jerseys, just know it's about to be an absolute hell game. Dude, these guys sweat the most. I, these guys sweat the most. <laughs> oh no, I'm, I'm, I'm in for a long one, aren't I? Everyone's going to overplay Steve Largent because his X Factor is lit up. Actually, maybe not. Hold up. Do I have something here right now? Oh, he switched over. Dude, I may have actually had something there if I called Hike a little sooner. We got X wide open. Oh, but the other safety came over and helped. Calvin, go get it. Damn. The other safeties are so fast, dude. If I just pass lead that a little bit better, maybe we actually have that. D, go get it. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go, Steve. Let's go, Steve. He's catching that pass every single time. If it hits his hands, it's his. Shit. We're going to have Ingram wide open. Dot that. Toes in. Let's get it. Go, go, go. Spin. Oh, oh, spin. Okay. Broken tackle. First down. This dude's falling forward like 10 yards. I got to snap that quicker. Steve, go get that, Steve. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. 
I, I'm gonna run this in though. I, I don't think it's worth uh, trying to throw a pass here and throwing an interception. We're, we're way too close. We got that. Let's go. Touchdown, Walter. Not a bad drive for Steve though. I feel like I'm not really using him the, to the best of his ability. I feel like actually no, I'm not doing bad with him though. He we had that 10 yard gain on that little drag, and this guy's probably gonna quit. So <laughs> we'll have another one if this guy does quit. All right, here we go. We're facing X O X Predator X O X, and he's got an absolute god squad. Damn, was that Derrick Henry and Baker Mayfield on the same team? This dude definitely spent too much money on this game, dude. Just, just, just a quick go route to Steve. We'll see if we get it. Dot that. Yeah, we got him. Touchdown, Steve. Let's get it. Yeah, he is facing probably not the best team. I probably, <laughs> I mean, but it is still a touchdown with Steve. I mean, he's going to quit on that. Well, I guess we'll have another game, though. We got, <laughs> we'll have another. All right, here we go. He's got Patrick Mahomes, Jerry Rice, and Pat Tillman. And there was our team, and his name is Pad Pants. Okay, Pad Pants. Wow, what a name. Okay, here we go. Pick, let's go. That's Sean T. Good then in sub and Taylor Mays yet. Sean T is just as much of a dog. He's got, yeah, he's got Ma he's got a uh, Rice with X Factor, and he's got Mahomes, and he's got Dickerson as well. If he's throwing corner routes too, okay. This guy's got this guy's a demon. He's he's a, he's a demon. He's a demon. He's not going out without a fight. No spy. Say less. That's a free ten. That's a free ten. Dot that. Dot that. Dot that. Dot that. Dot that. That's Tua. All right, here we go. Possession catch, Steve. And that's the worst animation in Madden. We should have B wide open right here. I'm just going to hit Steve. That'll be safe. Possession catch that. Let's go, Steve. We should have B open here. Tylon Lee. Get it there. Let's go. That's Gunslinger. You have to run Gunslinger. If you haven't tried Gunslinger yet, what are you doing? It's so, so good. This is not going to work. This is a terrible play call. Touchdown catch. Let's go, Steve. Touchdown. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. All right, here we go. It was kind of dotting me on offense on the first drive, but dudes usually do crumble in the red zone against me. I don't know what it is. They usually can drive up the whole field against me, but when it, once, it gets, once they come to the red zone, they're clueless. This dude's kind of lost. I don't know why he's not going to go back to what he was doing before. It was working like an absolute charm. Give me that pick. Well, Tion is so good. Don't quit. Don't quit. Don't quit. Don't quit. Please don't quit. Please don't quit. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to pick you off, bro. Don't quit. I'm trying to get a good gameplay for Steve Largent here today. And every single dude I face is quitting. Dot that. Possession catch. It's all day. It's all day for Steve. We should have Tory Hole here on B. We have Evan Ingram. Dot that. Great pass lead. Phenomenal pass lead. Give this touchdown. I'm actually going to try to run up. I'll try the post. It's going to be dangerous. Dotting his user, but we'll try it. Oh my god, what a dot. That's why you... <laughs> that was a terrible throw. I would quit on that too, bro. I'm not going to lie. I would quit on that too. Steve Largent, 5 receptions, 51 yards. All right, guys. So that's going to do it for the Steve Largent gameplay. My final review on this card is he's very solid. He's a 97 speed. 99's across route running, basically. Good catch in traffic. Good catching, as you saw in that last touchdown. Good spec catch. But do I think that using your 99 power pass on this guy is worth it? I don't think it's worth it because you have guys like Randy Moss, you have guys like Walter Payton, you have guys like LT, who are much better to use your power pass on. And also this guy's a limited time card, so he's going to be super expensive on the auction block, so most likely you're not going to be buying this card, you're going to be using your power pass on him if you do want to try him out or if you do want to get him. So like for that reason, the Steve Largen card is a W, but kind of an L at the same time. I kind of wish that they didn't make Steve Largen the limited time and they gave Simeon Rice the limited time. Gave us someone else on defense. And then next week, they gave us Steve Largent receiver and Sean Taylor, ultimate legend, next week. I would use this Steve Largent card, but I, it's, just not worth, it's just not worth having my 99 power pass on him. It's not. Like, I'd be running him as, like, my third guy, but I just can't do that because he, I'm using my power pass on him. And I don't think it's worth it at all. So, yeah, that's going to do it for the video. If you are new here, hit the subscribe button. We're on the road to 2,000 subscribers. We're less than 100 subscribers away. And like I said earlier... As you're watching this video, I'm most likely live on Twitch. So go ahead in the description and click on my Twitch and come check out the stream and the giveaway as well. Go ahead and join the giveaway. It's completely free and you can really win a free $25 gift card if you do enter. And uh, yeah, that's going to do it for the video. I will see you guys in the next one.